What's good, what's good? So while I was letting the car warm up, just got a class off of work as well, I decided to do a, a, a quick video. By the way, you know what I'm saying? Uh, if you ain't subscribed, subscribe right there. Or you get the notification bell right there. But either way, you know what I'm saying? Just stay tuned, you know what I'm saying? Keep up with me. But uh, I, I really don't know how to feel. It's going to be a part two to this. I'll just make it this quick. But I really don't know how to feel about the situation. But you know, I'm, I'm gonna show you how good things happen to those who wait and those who pe treat people well. You know, uh, back in my uh, my old job when I worked with uh, my cousins and all them, they conspired against me to get me out of there. You know, some didn't back me up or whatever. Oh well, I let it go, you know. People was against me because of my potential. I go to another job, Excel. Once they got to where they, they needed to be, you know, they didn't want to promote me. And it was well deserved to a manager. So, you know, they con they concocted a plan to get me up out of there. And uh, that's cool, that's fine. Uh, they asked to fire me on my day off from there. It's, I ain't even worried about it. Come to a new job, first month, first I trained two weeks. Then I come to another I come to a new shift. I work my butt off within the first two weeks. I get nominated for employee of the month. I didn't get it, but because they, they put it in a poll and they choose, but I got nominated for it. The uh, supervisor come to tell me, say, man, I like the way you work, man. Keep doing what you do. I'ma look out for you. You know what I'm saying? Because I, I show, you know, I pay attention to the tiny things, the small things. I do what I can, you know what I'm saying? I believe you work hard, you're supposed to get paid a reward. Might not be that day, might not be that month, might not be that year, but it'll come back some kind of way. Law of attraction, you speak it into existence. So, within three months, they do a layoff. And they're signed, they had the, 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 they had the HR people to call everybody, let them know they lay off. They never called me. Okay, my phone was off all that day. So when I get here, my car still worked. It's a, a guy that started a little bit out the idea. His didn't work. He still he walked all around to the guard shack, asked to come on in. He came on in. He was actually on the layoff list. And this is how good guy worked. That man told him, man, I'm not going home. I need a job. They took him off the layoff list, gave him a job. That man been here working. Ever since he ain't went nowhere, he's still working. He just moved on up to say, uh, first shift. He doing good, young, young guy. So proud of him. Me, on the other hand, I go in, I'm in the break room, and I'm like, I'm looking, they calling everybody names, sending them to their machines because you know, since people got laid off, they putting different people together, you know, for the machines. And I'm like, man, my name didn't get called, so the other guy. Other, other, this black guy looked at me like, man, what's going on? I'm like, man, I don't know. My name didn't get called. So I'm like, man, maybe I'm supposed to get laid off or something. And uh, he like, and I don't know. So he asked, what about James? So the uh, the plant manager's son say, which he's a plant manager, or LLC, he says, uh, I got something special for James. So he let everybody walk out. And him and all the supervisors and stuff there, they say, how would you like to be an inventory specialist, auditor, and a uh, utility? I said, absolutely. Especially as long as I got a job. Absolutely, you know, it's, it's a good paying job. I didn't want to leave the job, you know. To me, I mean, it, it, some people might call it hard work, but I'm like, it's steady work, it's easy to me. So I'm like, absolutely, like, yeah, so walk up, we're gonna move you up, we're gonna pay, you know, we're gonna take care of you. Cool, got me in there. Then, I, you know, they like, uh, and, and remember now, the uh, supervisor tip, you know, he, the one that told me to keep doing what I'm doing, he's looking out for me the whole time. He, he's giving me my name, uh, the recommendations and all that, he's doing this, so, and I never met him until I started working here. He's a, a Marine. Straight up guy, you know what I'm saying? Named Corey Maddox, by the way. Good good guy. 
everybody used to tell me, oh, he a hard ass. Oh, he's stubborn. He's stuck up all this neck. I got here, just did my job. And there's no problem. I ain't had no problem with it. I'm like, what's the problem? Oh, well, he'll say something to you. You know what I'm saying? Get smart about this. First of all, he's supposed to be stern in his, in his job. But he's only stern if you sit. I, I, the Most of the people that was complaining about him, every time I walk past their machine, they sitting on it. Or they ain't doing something. Or they talking to somebody else. They're not monitoring their machine. So you're not running nothing. So how can you get mad at him about it? So, you know, if he get down on your ass, it's because it's well-deserved. Make a long story short, another two months go by. Now, I ended up, when I went to uh, inventory specialist, I got under new uh, management. Got a new supervisor. And it's just, it's just me and her that does it. We do a whole side of the plant. Inventory, just me and her. She taught me, she teaching me everything she know. You know, I, at this moment, I still get taught some things, but I, I was already computer savvy, so there was no, no problem. You know, I actually teach her things on the computer. And uh, every a lot of people didn't like her. Me and her get along perfectly fine. You know, she called me at home if I'm at home. Like, look, when you come in tomorrow, I got such such waiting on the desk for you. Blah, blah. She don't bother me too much, but if she just really need to call to, to give me a heads up, she do. Fast forward, like I said, two months now. She has to go surgery. She's gonna be gone six to eight weeks, and I'm running it by myself. Look at that. But she made sure I was prepared. But this right here could be another opportunity to step forward some more because i'm trying to get all i can get i'm trying to get it all i'm trying to move as high as i can get and get as much as i can get until i get until i have to wear a suit every day to work that's why i'm trying to get if i'm trying to do, you know I, I work for myself as well but if i'm gonna do this you know what i'm saying then I'm, I'm i'm trying to go all the way to get what i need and then i can the more money i have i'm, I'm making the more i can further more my outside careers with my wife and what business we have and um uh, they got me in the lead management class. Got me taking these classes. And he was like, trust me, it's going to be uh, beneficial for you. You know, take it. You know, you know." he was like, just trust me, take it. So when I hear that, I'm like, listen, you need to take it. And he specifically told me I need to take it then. You know, it could be a blessing coming my way. Either way it go, I done learned some extremely great things for, you know, jobs and things like that in this class. So I'm, I'm extremely, I'm, I'm blessed, you know what I'm saying, uh, I'm fortunate, I'm thankful, you know what I'm saying, so, just the moral of the story is, you might get kicked, kicked down, you might be held down, but uh, only you can hold yourself down, as, you get, as long as you get back up, that's the thing, you know, everybody do whatever they can to you, as long as you get back up, that's what truly matters, you know, and uh, just make sure you, you push out positive, positively, positive vibes into you know out into the universe because what you push out is what you get in you know i really don't i don't, I don't really push out negative vibes no more i want to see the best out of people so and, and ever since i've i've tried to get rid of as much negativity as possible i've been getting a lot of positivity so for the people that just don't think that's the way it go yeah it does it's that simple it goes away you push out what you get in you might not get it that day but you're gonna get it just what you give out, you're gonna give in. The universe gonna give it to you. Just a quick one. Just wanted to holler at you.